What's up guys, it's your boy Darskin, and today we are going to be taking DPS, main DPS Ganyu for a spin. Now in my original video, I talked about my first impressions, which I mean it's in the title and in the video, but uh, people weren't satisfied, people were mad, people were like, no DS you're wrong, blah blah blah, how dare you call her support, she dishes out more damage than blah blah blah, so uh, I'm going to be taking her for another run, which I mean I've already seen her damage, I've, I've like, it's not like I don't know, she does a lot of damage, but I, I guess people want to see my, see me see her damage, I, I don't know, anyway, so we're going to be taking her into Abyss, well, let me go out so I can show you guys the build, but yeah, we're going to be taking her into Abyss, just so people can see me see her do her stuff, um, 1980 attack, right, um, if you look at the details, 56 crit rate, which, I mean, we're probably going to get more crit rate inside the um abyss or something anyways um 178 crit damage uh energy recharge is kind of low um but i mean i'm not gonna be like i, I want to use her for her ult obviously but um the ult isn't going to be the main part of it it's going to be a charge shot so that's okay um 61 cryo damage um so anyway uh, going on to our weapons, going to be Skyward Harp, level 70, and then you're going to, um, I'm going to be running two-piece Gladiator, two-piece, uh, Blizzard. If you guys want to see what's on it, crit rate, crit damage, attack percent, um, crit rate, elemental mastery, energy recharge, attack per percent, main stat, attack, crit rate, energy recharge, elemental mastery, this one is crowd damage, it, it didn't roll, like, it didn't have any good substats, but it is a cryo set cup with cryo damage, so it's like, that is almost impossible to get again, so... Um, anyway, crit damage, attack percent, crit rate, ele uh, elemental mastery, and that's going to be what she's running. I have no, um, constellations on her talents, level six. So, uh, yeah, we're going to be getting her into, and we're actually going to be going to floor, um, abyss floor eight. And the reason why is because she's level 70. So, um, how the game works, right? If you're going against enemies that are higher leveled, you're going to do less damage. So, um, I'm going to go against enemies of equal level. I'm going to be putting her on the second stage with the pyro enemies. So, um, just so we can actually have a solid, uh, look, right? I don't want to basically cheat Ganyu's damage by not going to something that's actually going to, uh, you know, benefit her. Now, the first one, I'll run whatever, right? Um, the first one doesn't matter. Um, but anyways, for Ganyu's team, I'm going to be running her, Bennett. Um, I mean, we could run Fire Buff, Venti, and then... Just run Amber, just to have Amber, like, doesn't matter, whatever, right? Um, and then Team 1, I'm going to run, like, something like this, I guess. And this is the, I, I need Fire because the Cryo, uh, so we'll run that, right? But anyway, so I'll run, I'll run Fire buff on her, and then uh, we're going to use Venti as well. But you guys won't see the first half, I'll skip that, but we'll see the other one. So I'll see you guys there. Alright, so we are on this side with Ganyu, we're going to be getting into this, and uh, seeing exactly... What she's looking like, what she can do. Now, first we gotta get these, uh... We gotta get these shields off. Alright. I mean, we could just pop her ult, actually. He tried to leave, bro. Nah. You good? Alright. Good damage, good damage. Eleven thousand, eighteen thousand, boom, and that's level seventy, right? Keep in mind, she's going against enemies that are her level. Um, level seventy equal with the enemy I hit for what? Eleven thousand, and then eighteen thousand seven hundred. So just imagine, once I get her um, talents. Up to seven, eight, nine, whatever. And imagine once I get her to 90 and get her weapon to 90. Because this is a level 70 weapon as well. Very, very good damage. Alright, alright. So we're on the uh, other side. And, um... I, I don't even know what we're fighting at all. Um, oh, okay. Oh, 14,000. Oh, <laughs> that's with no melt, by the way, right? Oh, 
Y'all like that iframe? Alright, I'm about to ult y'all, man. Go ahead and pop this. I mean, do what you want, man. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm clear. Literally, any enemy that's of equal level, I just destroy it. Very, very good. All right, and for the last stage, we're fighting the... Um... Oh, wow, I'm just taking damage? Hello? Uh, we're fighting the Pyro Regis Vaughn. I don't know why that's still there, but anyway... Oh, this is going to take a lot longer. And those follow you. I mean, I, I kind of just, yeah, as soon as I, I was about to say, as soon as I get ult, I kind of just break it. And then pop Venti ult. Oh, well, that was a 21,000 headshot, and then uh, it just died. So, <laughs> um, anyway, um, so as you can see, my not even that built Ganyu does a lot of damage, right? So, I can only imagine the people that have, like, actual good gear. Like, imagine if I had four-piece uh, retracing bow lead, right? Because four-piece retracing bow lead gives you 40% um, increased damage to normal and charged attack, right? Which, I, I'm not even running that. Or Wanderer's True. So, imagine with those, I'm doing even more damage. So, trust me when I tell you, I, I know she does damage. Now, I will say, I personally like support Ganyu better. But, I do see why everyone is going crazy over DPS Ganyu. Because DPS Ganyu, or main DPS Ganyu, is amazing. Needless to say. So, trust me, I've seen the light, or I see the light, anyway. Um... I 100% understand why people love main DPS Ganyu so much. Um, I think I, I'm, I'm probably in the minority, which is perfectly fine. But I like support Ganyu. But that's, I mean, I'm pretty unorthodox with my, like, main DPS picks to begin with, right? I, like, with Beto. And then I run, like, combo DPS, Zhongli, Albedo, or GOMC. So, um, but yeah, I, I definitely see the damage. And you got to realize... Her damage is constantly every, what, two, three seconds because of the charge shot, whereas everybody else is an ability, so it's on a much longer cooldown. So, um, she definitely has the potential to be one of the top, like, three to five DPS, if not the top DPS in the game. So, anyway, that's going to be for this video. Be sure to give it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below. Tell me what you guys think in the comment section about that being said. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.